I'm going to give you a quick overview of Tweet Photo for iPhone. In the first column here, you'll see friends. So you can easily see all of your friends' photos in a photo stream. You can take any of those photos and drill into them and quickly uh, see the, the finer details. Uh, same with the public stream. You're able to see uh, all of the photos that are coming through the Tweet Photo platform live. Additionally, you can also look at what's popular. So think of this as trending photos and you'll be able to see all of the photos that are really popular across the platform. Additionally, you can uh, look at a specific person's uh, photos and see more, uh, all of their photos. So here's Apollo Ono's and we can see a variety of uh, the photos that he's uploaded over the past uh, few days. And you can take the photo and actually drill into that. And you can also look at stats uh, for any photo on the platform, as well as look at the, uh, the recent viewers on, on any of those photos. One other thing that's really nice is that you can easily vote up or down. You can favorite or you can leave a comment. So when you go to leave a comment, you'll see all the other comments there. And then you can leave a comment. It says basically, great job. And then post that comment. It will immediately be posted uh, into the Tweet Photo platform and your connected social networks. Additionally, uh, you can see all of your photos very easily. And one nice feature about uh, Tweet Photo is that it actually has a mapping feature so that you can look at uh, a standard Google map or a satellite map or a hybrid map, which is actually really nice to be able to see uh, where photos were taken. And the last page here is actually the option. So push notifications will uh, pop onto your iPhone when friends either upload a photo or comment. And we're also linking services. So you can link your Twitter account, your Facebook account, Foursquare account, etc. And one last thing that I actually want to show you is that it's really easy to upload. So you can either use your camera or you can use the photo library to upload a photo very quickly. And that's really Tweet Photo in a nutshell really quick in just about two minutes. I encourage you to download it for free from the iTunes store and have a look and play with it. And we'll see you on Tweet Photo.